Welcome to our course Certificate in Building Information Modeling Level 2. This course is presented by Engineer Ayman Kondin. This course will take an overview for the BIM Essential and BIM Definitions. First, we need to go through the course content. This course gives you an overview of the BIM concept generally and the responsibilities. First, BIM definition. Second, BIM dimension. Third, what is the difference between the BIM and traditional methods used in design, like CAD? Fourth, what is the mean of BIM uses or what is the different uses for BIM? Number five, BIM application. What are the different applications we can use using BIM? Number six, BIM implementation factors. What are the factors affecting on BIM implementation in every organization? Also, what are the restrictions for using BIM for this organization? Number seven, BIM levels of development. What is the LOD? What is the definition of level of development and what is the difference between level of development and level of details number eight what are the BIM responsibilities what is the difference between BIM manager what is the difference between BIM manager and the BIM uh, coordinator what is the BIM coordinator what is the BIM specialist what is the BIM analyst what is the BIM modeler. So in BIM responsibilities, we will take into consideration all this difference between these roles. Number nine, what is the BIM level maturity? What are the level and where are we staying now? Number 10, we will go through BIM executing plan. How to start your plan for your organization from scratch. First, BIM executing plan from collecting the information from the employer up to finalizing the BIM executing plan. This will be in lesson number 10. Last lesson, we are dealing with employer information requirement. What are the requirement shall I provide for the employer regarding to his requirement. After I collecting the, this requirement, I will finalizing my BIM executing plan. First, introduction about the instructor, engineer Ayman Kondil, Autodesk certified BIM specialist in routes and highway solution for infrastructure design suite package ultimate. Autodesk Certified BIM Specialist Instructor Autodesk Certified Professional for Civil 3D and Revit Autodesk Student Ambassador Write monthly in BIM Arabia First BIM Magazine in Middle East Excellence Award in Civil Engineering from Arab Engineers Community Okay, let's start to begin our course for the concept of BIM, what is the definition of BIM? Starting lecture number one, BIM concept. We have many discrepancies between the definition of BIM. Some people will saw this like this elephant, someone will say it's a spear, someone will say no it's a snake. It's a tree, it's a fan, if he catching his ear, he will say it's a fan, it's a wall, it's a rope. So we are trying to unify this definition for BIM. What is the unified definition of BIM? What is the BIM? BIM is building information modeling. Building information modeling is the process of generating and managing building data during its life cycle. 
So it's a managing and generating of the information during the life cycle of the project. BIM uses three dimension real time dynamic building modeling software to increase productivity in building design and construction. So we are converting from 2D drawing to 3D drawing, which already have three dimension with real time dynamic building modeling. We are using software dealing with 3D modeling and 4D, 5D, which enhance the productivity of design. To create a BIM, a modeler uses intelligent object families to build this model. So what is the meaning of smart element? Smart element is the element have some information we can fill this information to get the 3D object. At any environment, this 3D object has some properties like this window if you're dealing with a window window has a width a lens and has a thickness once you enter this properties and move this from one environment one program to the other program it will go not 3d object only it will go by its characteristics and its properties so this is called by intelligent object or smart object its object has some information this information has the ability to transfer from one program to the second program not only 3d lines what not only 3d lines but also by its properties so what is the definition of bim we say b like building i for information m for modeling Let's start with building. What is the definition of building? Building may be any construction project, not only building by its story building. So building can be high-rise building, maybe roads, maybe stadium, maybe infrastructure project, also maybe a bridge and so on. So building not only mean for building by its name, but building mean build any project. What is the history of BIM? BIM have started since 1970. However, the extensive use of hardware was the reason of not being spread previously, as the hardware back then was weak. Ancient and couldn't represent the characteristic of building in digital form. It was first executed under the concept of virtual construction via Archicad software for Graphisoft company beginning from 1987. This is the first real implementation of the term for BIM. So BIM is the mean of building information model. What is the BIM? BIM is just a tool or it's a methodology, a way of working or it's a boss. We need to ask ourselves, it's just a tool or it's a methodology how to deal with these tools and how to manage this information between the models or this a way of working or it's a boss.